again. I'm, I'm ending up with micro potatoes. Little teasers. Uh, so I'm gonna continue to put them in here and dig this up. But I'm hoping I'm gonna get a few improvements on my soil. Obviously, not enough. So, this is not very exciting. So, let's see what I come up with here. Okay, hey, these are. I believe these are what turn into the butter for the moths and your tomatoes. This is my yield. There's a baby of all babies. And then here was potentially going to be a big potato. Alright, now I have squirrels on uh, my top down, lying down. And there's one left. But uh, this is not just because of squirrels. Soil. I need more nutrients for soil. And, uh, now, these bugs, I believe, are going to eat your tomato plants, moths. everybody can learn from that don't know all right so I'm trying to show this just for the purposes of learning those of you that may not have much knowledge about this I don't have much I knew it the soil probably needed more nutrients um, there was some flowers planted here where there's some potting soil and whatnot and mended the soil but that was a while back from what I understand and so this is the end results not enough nutrients in the soil and then having animals get to the vine or the plant growing on top um, so it had plenty of water when they need quite a bit of water I'll leave it one over water and uh, more nutrients in your soil and you got nice big Russet potatoes, because that's what those are. They should be big restaurant potatoes. Uh, so, remember, easy two tips and tricks. We use the everything up close and personal. Tell a friend, share it out. It's a win win win. United we stand and united we make it happen. Bye for now. God bless. Take care. And I'll be uploading another video on paintbrush techniques, cutting in, etc. Paint, paint prep. Um, paint prep before you paint. 
I look forward to seeing you, hearing from you, and tell a friend. God bless you. Share this out. Bye for now. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up.